we are no longer able to carry to go beyond what we are suffering now. It's something so uncontrollable uh, that's eating your community up. So we are fighting, we are suffering from the same problem. We need to stop putting CO2 into the atmosphere. But once it's already in there, Carbon removal is one of the few tools that directly addresses that cause of suffering. So carbon dioxide removal is the act of taking carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere and putting it away at a time scale that is impactful for climate. We've built a direct recapture facility that actually removes carbon from the air and permanently sequesters it into concrete. I go to work every day with 13 Kenyans who are really motivated to solving the greatest problem of our time. Human ingenuity is something that I would bet on every single day. Carbon removal needs to happen. It's not a question of like, can we do this? We must do this. We must find a way. I'm a big fan of algae. I think they quite literally will save the world. We as human beings need to be continuously searching for opportunities to, to solve this, this issue of climate change, to really try and make an impact, and I think we'll succeed. With the journey we started, it's very ambitious to do it, but we're on track. How do we bring in industries that use energy and give the license to develop everything as quickly as possible? Sarcasm, sequestering it, I'm using it as the kryptonite for carbon. There are policies and stakes that are being put in place of like, here's what we want to see with carbon removals. Scientists have known that this is possible for a really long time. One of the ways to pull CO2 out of the atmosphere, which is the weathering of rocks. So it's a win-win situation for growers. Biochar had so many different applications. One big bag, 1.5 tons of CO2. A nature-based solution to grow microalgae for the purpose of carbon sequestration. We need to stop just talking about it, we need to take a real action. If you want to go really fast, you want to go together. We better get it right in the first place because we really don't have a second shot here. All hands on deck.